How's it going, guys? Figured I'd do a little update video on the uh, big block Chevy Cavalier. Um, doesn't look like I've done much, but at the same time, it does look like I've done a lot. Um, bumper's just kind of sitting on there. It had some self-tappers that they had holding it in, so I put it back on there. Had to take the timing cover off because it wasn't on there. Resealed it and uh, got it on there. Still got to find my crank pulley uh, installer. Can't find that. I just got the intake and the uh, bug catcher and carburetor sitting on there. Um, still got to get some intake gaskets. Got the MSD box back mounted where it used to be in the coil. Uh, got to go pick up some bell housing bolts later this afternoon. I got one of the torque converter bolts in just to try to figure out where everything goes. You know, it's, when you don't build a car or you aren't the one that takes it apart, it's kind of hard to remember where everything goes. But um, what else? What have I done? Not a lot. I hadn't spent a lot of time on it. Um, I got the fuel cell somewhat mounted back underneath there. Um, they used really crappy hardware to mount that. And so I snapped off one of the bolts tightening it, which I don't feel like I was tightening it that much. But <clears throat> so I had to get that taken care of. I've done anything inside. I cleaned out the inside so you can kind of see it now. It smells like an old Cavalier, that's for sure. But uh, that's pretty much it. Sunroof. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. Just a small little update video. Just to let you guys know where I'm at and how it's going. I ended up buying another truck. That obviously was wrecked a little on the front end and the back end and everywhere. But anyway, bought that to be my new run around shop truck. And I'm gonna sell my little single cab long bed truck. So trying to, and then I've got the, uh, a 1976 Dodge Dart I'm working on too. So trying to balance a lot of projects at once. And uh, so just taking one thing at a time and working on it a little bit here and there. And of course balancing customers cars as well. So but yeah, that's, uh, that's it for today. Um, gonna make a parts run either this afternoon or tomorrow, probably tomorrow and uh, pick up several of the things I need, like the bell housing bolts and uh, intake gaskets and such. My goal is to um, have this running by, I got a very busy week next week, but I would love to have this running by, say, just running, not driving. I'd love to have it running by next week, then next weekend, next Sunday. So, yeah, that's it. it uh, also, if anybody knows anything about this car, reach out i'd love to hear about it um i don't know much i've seen some pictures that people have sent me through the uh, sloppy mechanics uh facebook page of back when they saw this car at the super chevy show in like 05 or 06 and then of course there's a um, that car show sticker there uh, this thing apparently has been all around ohio indiana and stuff like that possibly up in michigan as well um just going to shows and that's my goal. My goal is to fix this thing up. I might even get it repainted and um, put the tunnel ram back on it. And we'll try to find one. I want to put this thing back to what it used to be in 2005. Just take it to shows, have fun with it, win some trophies, and just have something that people will remember for the next 20 years. Clearly, people remember this car from 20 years ago, and I want kids to see it now and remember it 20 years from now when they're an adult. Hopefully, it's still around then. But Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and uh, like I said, I'll try to upload a update video every time I get a little bit of something done. So, all right, guys, y'all have a good week. All right, guys, got the uh, bell housing bolts in. That took that was not fun. Um, got the intake back off. Got a coat of paint on it, drying right now. Got the uh, water pump on and installed. Got the balancer installed. I got it sitting on top dead center right now so I can just drop the distributor in once this intake dries. One step at a time, a couple hours a day, eventually it'll be running. Didn't have any yellow that even came close to matching that, so I'm just going with cast coat aluminum. Painted back cast coat aluminum. But anyway, alrighty. Well, I'll resume when I've got more work done. Well, I got the uh, 
intake on and uh, carburetor bolted on. I got the distributor sitting in there. Unfortunately, the crank pulley is uh, not in the pile of parts I got. So I'll have to figure that out. And uh, the headers don't fit. Came, definitely came off this car. They are all over the motor mounts here. So I'm gonna have to figure that out. He either put the motor mounts on backwards or something. I'm not exactly sure, but I'm gonna have to uh, figure that out. So, all right, I'll pick back up when I get some more work done. 